New information on an elderly woman attacked. Police are searching for the robber who punched her repeatedly inside her apartment building lobby. This morning, that woman is recounting the terrifying experience. CBS 2's Rena Roy joins us live with more on the story from the West Village. Rena? Well, Andrea and Cindy, we just spoke to that 81-year-old victim, and she's actually in pretty good spirits for what just happened to her. She tells us she feels the experience made her stronger. You can see officers are standing guard outside her apartment building here on West 13th Street, where this all happened just before 7 p.m. last night. Take a look at this surveillance video. It's pretty disturbing to watch. You can see that suspect punching 81-year-old Barbara Davison in the face repeatedly. Police say he was able to make off with her purse. She tells us she went to the pharmacy around the corner and he followed her into her building. She fell to the ground during the attack, calling out for help. Neighbors rushed to her aid, helping her up and calling 911. Davison has lived here for about 40 years. She is a working actress. She tells us she just filmed a movie this year. You can see her in this movie from 2008 with Adam Sandler in Don't Mess with the Zohan. She says she's thankful things did not end up worse and says she's usually pretty careful but may have been a Target because she's older and uses a cane. Well, you know, I was a mark. I was an easy mark. I was just about ready to put the key in the door when I felt, you know, felt the really big blow on my head, and I couldn't see the person because I was facing the door of the apartment. So I turned around. And just as I turned around, I had real pain. As I turned around, I just saw my red. I have a big red bag. I saw the red bag flying out the door. And police are still looking for that suspect, but Davison says she is uh, optimistic that he will be caught. We're live in the West Village this morning. Rena Roy, CBS 2 News. And we're glad she's okay. Rena, thank you.